If you don't know, now you know. I was in a village in France. It is true, I was in a village in France and I was playing a show at a room, one thirty-seventh the size of this room. And it was full of French persons. And at the end of the night I was selling some smirches. And I shit you not, hipster Gandalf approached me. He was a leather jacket, half in the bag, long gray hair. And in a broken French accent, he says, you need to follow me. <laughs> and I don't speak French, so naturally I followed him. And he led me up a block away and down a dark alley that is older than our country. And um, into an apartment that was older than our country. And uh, forgotten like our country is right now. And and it looked like it got hit by a bulldozer. And, but everywhere there was metal sculptures. I mean, everywhere. In the way like, and, and not in the way like, ooh, metal sculptures, but in the way like, oh, don't turn your back to this person. <laughs> and, so, and they were like tiny ones, big ones. And then like, you, you know that nanosecond of brain where you say that's not real, where you're like, wait, do people get turned into metal sculptures in like a horror movie? And, uh, and then he said, I heard you through the walls of my studio tonight and it connected with me and um, it instructed me to get this piece of metal and I thanked him for the metal. He said, no, I need to carve you in it. And he pulled, he put it on a piece of wood in the doorway overlooking this valley and he took out, there's two tanks of gas and he took out a flame torch with no gloves, half Gandalf, half in the back, lit it up and sparks started flying everywhere in the night and he's carving into the metal and then he disappears and there's this molten red piece of metal in front of me and I'm still scared for my life, and I still I can't look away, and I still think, like, I'm gonna be on the quest for the magic ring. And, <laughs> and he comes back, and he has his hand in a fist, and I'm like, this is it. I'm like, shoulder with apart, right, puff your chest up, and he stand before me with his fist. <laughs> and he says, they're taking all the gold in our world to use in our machines so that we can communicate with each other, our cell phones, our laptops, our cars, they mine the gold and they put it in these machines so that we can be connected, but we're less connected. We're not even seeing each other, talking to each other. It's overwhelming to connect. The fake connection is so overwhelming because it's hard to feel for everyone's misery, misery and everyone's joy at the same time. And, it's, and it, it's just daunting on all of us and we're all exhausted. And, and so, he still had a fist. And, um, <laughs> And, but I'm like, okay, this is going somewhere. And he opens it, and there's a nugget in his hand, like an a actual nugget like you pull from the water of gold. And he says, actual communicating with people and being an artist, that's what we need. You have to keep going, you're a real communicator. And he took the gold and he took the torch, and I noticed now that the sculpture that he made was a man, and he had pulled the man out of the sculpture, stepping forward, and he took the gold and he melted it on his foot. And he says, be a golden walker and keep going, which, yeah. and for a second I'm like, I could just be like, oh, I'm the only one, but it wasn't, no, this is like all of us. <laughs> it's like, um, it's, on all, it's on all of us because um, we're bombarded by uh, the everything. And um, I, I I'm, I'm hoping this is a good lead into this next song. I don't. <laughs> but to answer your question, that's why the album's called Golden Walker. I was like, how did I fucking get here? And our skies behind your sullen eyes And your eyes are wet with rain I'm sure I left the pile of crime Somewhere on the path Not too far behind Where I'm walking now Though I cannot see Or understand them today I'm pretty sure Love is a combination of 
chemicals necessary to make it through the day. Like this. Be the ultimate companion. Be the ultimate companion. Be the ultimate companion. Be the ultimate companion. I'm sure I qualify for the best smile in a loop de loop or an overturn car in a roadside dish as the world traffic flies on by. This could be the perfect day to prove to you that I can still be the ultimate companion, be the ultimate. Companion, be the ultimate companion. 